We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. But what really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. I... We need you strong. Okay. Come on, let's go. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. It's been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Yeah. Bridge coming up. Take it easy. Davy, too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got a fire and shelter. That's a start. And what about the money? Please tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It's stashed with the rest of the money in town. It'll be safe for now. But we sure can't go back there to collect it anytime soon. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is, or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Hey, Arthur, let me take the rear. You move up. Passing you. Okay, go. Idiot. <laughs> Much. 
shelter. So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no... Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Okay, let's head down there. Let's hitch up here. Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. Someone's having fun in there. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. Micah, get down behind that wagon in front. Arthur! Get in position. Come on. Hello? Shut up, Billy. Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. <laughs> we can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the train. Arthur, we got a problem. <laughs> folks. There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur. need some... There's a body of food. in the wagon. Shit! Look out! There's more to bed! <laughs> seem to be going too well. Goddamn, are Crisco boys here? Why? I don't know. Maybe the same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, Whiskey. Oh, I'm starving. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. Strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Huh. Looks like the poor bastard was married, too. At some point. 
If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Meet me out here when you're done. Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin and see what we missed. Sure. At an old mining camp southwest of here, near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Just let <laughs> Dealt with. Good. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Get that horse hitch. Don't want him bolting. Get away from me! Michael, ah! what the hell do you think you're doing? Ah! Hold still, Dad. Ah! Ah! Oh, look, I found in the cellar. Wild thing, ain't ya? Leave her alone! I was 
wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them O'Driscolls. No, she ain't, Michael. Look at her. Miss, miss. Are you... Fuck, you fool. Michael. Miss, now, it is going to be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss, miss. Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on now. Oh. Are you okay, miss? They came three days ago. And my husband, they... Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. You come with us. Arthur. Miss, it's okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. No. Uh, it's okay. Uh, get on. Uh, we'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. He... He was my husband. Hey! Somebody's coming! Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back! How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this... Poor soul, Mrs. Adler. Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know the situation were reversed and he looked for me thank you this way last I know John was headed up the river for all we know he kept riding north and never looked back he wouldn't leave not like that uh, wouldn't be the first time
guys see some smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well... Seems somebody left. Recently. And... That way. Sure, well, come on there. There's some tracks leading to the river. Cross. See, they continue up that way. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkerton. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Watch out for this crevice. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. wall here. Davy got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hard again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. It's getting narrow here. Come on, boy. Horses are getting tired. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on, up there. That shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? You getting that gun then? This way. You sure about this? 
It's coming from this way. Okay. Careful here. Mierda, yeah, we're high up here. You're telling me. down here. Watch yourself. Watch out here. Watch your head here. Okay. Good now. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. Come on. That sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John! That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. <clears throat> Freezing. <clears throat> don't die just yet, cowboy. Compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You all right? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Look up there. Shit. You head for the horses. I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. All right, John, come on. Let's get you on that horse.
Come on then. Let's get back to the others. Yeah. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a a dog bite. Uh, knew a fella. Got bit by a dog. Died. An hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now. We should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Some help. We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Right, here we go. There we go. Uh, Ay, uh, careful. Uh, Idiotas. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're going to get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. So what now, Dutch? We get strong, we get warm. And we wait. When the storm breaks, we move. But we're safe here. Warm enough. I guess. Boys, because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lamb, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, 
there'll be a party. <laughs> <laughs> <A party. laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop <laughs> it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Colm O'Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Cole always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now, you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscoll's about. Yeah! Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. You said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score of their planet. that tracks horses quite a few of them as far as i can tell the only fools out here are us and them they must be this way you good dutch of course listen i know you don't think much of my ideas recently but this is the right move okay you know i got your back I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. Ugh. And people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can't forget. What he did to Hannibal. I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Hold up here. Gentlemen, this is it. Are we goddamn ready? ready? Ready, Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go.
There they are. That's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get them? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. Come on, let's get down there. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. You boys be ready to pick them off from up there. Sure thing. That rifle's no use to us sitting on your horse, Arthur. circle around the far side and go down that way, same as Mike and Bill. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur, Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including comb, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now, come on. Watch out. This bit's steep. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running... Hush. Let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. Stay low. Come on, follow me. Get in cover, Arthur. Ready for this job to be done. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? 
go. So we got everything we need. Yep. Bomb's got the map. We have okay. I'll go first. We are ready to roll. How soon? When they give the word. There is what the hell is doesn't give a damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. If you can shoot a gun and ride a horse and kill without thought, you're in. Oh shit! Look out! More of the bastards coming out of the trees! Dead 
Birds are running away. Good work, boys. Back to the camp. We'll get what we need. Clear out. around Arthur get over here good work boys now let's tear this place apart Bill you go search that wagon there Mike search that building Arthur you take that building to the left all right, man, quick! Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go! Here. This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. Smells good. Come on. Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. All right, let's get out of here. Proud of you boys. All of you. Not a man down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pummel us hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us. And I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get cold, but this hit will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> Yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Hey, you see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Colm? Leave him to me. All right, we're heading back. Just bring him back alive. He could be useful. Okay, you got it. Ah! Come on. Stay back! I know 
used to you, really. Now the fun. Please don't. What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't know your name? It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy. Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! Let me go. I'll disappear. I'll go to Mexico. I'm begging you. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. <laughs> oh, I think I'm gonna puke. Just let me go, please. Oh, God, please, no. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay, okay. That's two bones right there. Shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. That was good work, boy. <clears throat> don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting. Save fellas. Is need saving, and feed him. Is need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it. An O'Driscoll in my camp. I ain't an O'Driscoll, Mister. I, I hate that fella. Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. <laughs> 